Now, if you were in his shoes, knowing those final three girls, is there one that stands out to you that you would prefer if you were in his position? You know, if there was one out of, out of the three, I would just say Vanessa. Um, but you know, that's just me. I think I think they're all they're all great, though. You know, I would say Vanessa out of all of them. Anything in particular that stands out to you about Vanessa that is she just seem like more wife material, or? You know, I think so. I think the couple episodes that I've watched of the show, um, she didn't kind of hold back with anything when she saw things going on or when she had questions. Um, I remember the show when Corinne was kind of all over Nick and that little bouncy thing. Um, she definitely had questions and reservations about everything and if she was taking it seriously and she approached the situation and a lot of people just kind of talk amongst themselves and don't approach the bachelor or bachelorette, but she had no problem in approaching Nick and being like, listen, if this is what you're going to do, then I'll just leave. So I, I always like somebody who's um, kind of poignant with, with what they want you know, to to happen in the situation there. So I like that. Do you think Andy and Nick would ever be together again? After knowing both Andy and Nick um, pretty well, I think they're they're perfect for each other. You know, I didn't really watch last night. I, I barely watched. I just got back from Los Angeles. Um, I just moved into a new place, so I didn't have time. I tried to dabble before I did the interview with you today. Um, <laughs> but yeah, I think I think they're they're great for each other. Is there any chance with you and Andy getting back together? Oh no, absolutely not. No, um, <laughs> no, there's there's no chance. You know, I probably, you know, I really could care less about even talking to her again and everything. So, you know, when I ended that relationship a while ago, that was the last time I spoke with her, um, and I don't intend to do that again. Gotcha. Yeah. Um, how about uh, Amanda? You don't have to ask about that. How are things going? <laughs> are you guys uh, just taking a hiatus? Is there a chance you're going to get back together? You know, after the show. You, it was very difficult just with how everything was shown and portrayed. Um, we had a great time. You know, we fell in love. We thought everything was great, and then it was tough um, at the during the season. Um, so we kind of had to fight an uphill battle for a little while, and, you know, it wasn't an easy thing to do. But right now, you know, we saw each other uh, about a week ago back in Los Angeles, kind of ran into each other when I was out. And, um, you know, there's a lot of things that we need to talk about, a lot of things that – you know, we kind of need to get off our chest and everything like that. But we're trying to work on things in more of a private manner this time, um, especially taking into consideration Kins and Char, um, the girls. So we don't want to rush anything or or say anything that's not going to happen. Um, but we are talking a little bit right now, and we are going to see what happens. So are you officially back together? I wouldn't say we're back together, but we're working on things right now. You know, there's a lot of things that... Um, you know, that happened, and there were a lot of struggles during our relationship. There were tons of incredible times, don't get me wrong, um, but there was a lot of inconsistency as well. And, you know, for me, I know at least when I'm in a relationship, I want to be with somebody who's my best friend, who I can trust, who I can be with all the time. And um, that's where we got to – we have to get to that point in order for, you know, anything to work out. What about dating naked? Would you try that one? <laughs> Remember, man, I said no more dating shows for me. Oh, that's right. Yeah, but if you're naked, I thought maybe it would I mean, I don't like being naked and everything like that. I'm, I'm totally cool with that. But uh, as far as the dating is concerned, I just, I'm just not sure. I was very optimistic, you know, the first couple times around. But uh, I'm not sure that uh, it really ends up being the best thing for me. So currently, are you dating anyone or are you single? No, I'm single right now. Okay. Now, who is your like? Who is your celebrity crush? <laughs> ah, there was a woman back in the day that I thought was a, a gorgeous woman, and one of my friends knew her. Uh, but Derek Jeter just married her, Hannah Davis. Um, <laughs> yeah, she's a good person and stuff. So she's off the market. Um, now, of all the seasons of Bachelor and Bachelorette, which castmate is your least favorite? You know, I don't really get along too well with uh, with Nick, obviously. Um, yeah, I really don't probably need to explain that and the reasons and stuff. So, but um, yeah. definitely not, not not his biggest fan, and, and I'm sure he's not my biggest fan either. So, now uh, I know that you meet a lot of celebrities. Uh, what celebrity have you enjoyed meeting the most? The guy I really really liked. We had a great time, hung out all night for a couple nights. Is uh, Brody Jenner? Really down oh. to earth, good dude. Um, just overall, just 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 a good person, just a fun, down to earth person. And what were you guys doing? Were you at an event or? Yeah, um, we hosted an event out there. One of my friends from Bachelor in Paradise, Vinny, he was DJing, and I was mm -hmm. going to be out there already because I had to do a couple shoots. So I decided to head over there and support him in his DJing ventures. Um, and I didn't realize Brody was a DJ as well. So 
we all kind of hung out that night, hung out the next night, and just had a nice chill weekend and everything. Now, if Brody tried to hook you up with one of his sisters, would you be interested in that? <laughs> I told you, you know, I've got a. I told you, Amanda and I are in the are in the um, oh, that's right. of, of talking and working things out. So I can't even say that, or I wouldn't even say it because it'd be disrespectful. So right. I <laughs> that's not on, that's not on my mind right now. What celebrity have you met that you've enjoyed meeting the least? Well, maybe Nick and Andy. Maybe those are two. Oh, I mean, that's, a, that's a given for sure. For sure. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if I'd consider that a celebrity, but yes. 